Pangilam Kalyang Prasha U Doctor Mukul Sangma Mantakasni Kakandai Trek Unaidor Arajar Upsau Ula Sanga Yakasorkar MDA Kablash Pinsarwa Kai Kipisau Pai Ba Ban Pinbyang Paharai Kiryu Shimet Kibamdan Kam Satya and Ray Tang Bakinyo Pen H them but Pin Ik Losh Pai Ba. Have a cringe clap at high ball, Doctor Mukul Longba, Hato Kini Denjimai E. Kijim Janki, Ban Pinbyang Pahara, Kabalapin with a pin ewed Ik Pai Ba. Kani Kadiga Kam Kai, Bakasorkar, a penan Kam Baklai Kipulin, Balka Pisa Pai Ba, but uncrinting E. Kane Hakajinilang Janka Security Commission. Long ba ha ka sorkar jung umen shwaru ki tungi ki chairman Henry ka sorkar kam jipun biang pahara eki Long ba ki ba yob an pahara ki bor ka an ki ditang ki tu ki badan ka nuga nuga jing ma hai ka jing im jang ki Henry om an penan kam baklai ka bor Ula bu jing keliru ba ki chairman advisor ha ka sorkar ki yob pahara pulit ka bulong persha e ka an Long ba unda wa ba ki tu ki opisar ki pepin biang pahara eki Politician give a shikwa banyat banachadem, but pintut ikipat ba, bakidi ban siu ikipisa baro, kabakila pilut iki namar ba, kade jong pat ba, omde nagapla, la jong jonki. One part to reflect hmm. their the nepotism, favoritism with which they have been running this government with complete sense of impurity. Okay, now it doesn't end there. It doesn't end there. It goes beyond. It doesn't end in the notified parks and facilities which are eligible for those incumbent political appointees. No. It goes beyond that. You go and see for yourself of various other uh, privileges and facilities from different line departments which are provi being provided to them. One is the police department. Okay. One is the police department. I would be asking, demanding for a security, state security commission meeting to take cognizance of this unnecessary wastage of money from public exchequer by misusing the police authorities. You see how many of these political appointees are provided with all kinds of so-called, what do you call them? The security cover, the security cover to all those uh, uh, political appointees. You look at uh, uh, what is the what is the uh, category of uh, protective. We have the protectives for the police department to provide all the facilities. Okay, whose life is under threat? Tell me, whose life is under threat? Tell me which of these political appointees have taken, you know, the insurgency and militancy and other issues head on to bring peace, that their life is so threatened? If somebody's life is threatened, huh, based on which the level of protection to be given by the police for that indicated protective has to be worked out. Now you will ring up to the uh, SP and tell, no, give this, this security to, to this particular gentleman. This is how you want to spend money from the scarce uh, public exchequer. No. We will have proper due diligence and accounting of everything. And if unnecessarily protection has been given by giving police vehicle, by giving police personnel to just run around with them to uh, show off, you know, and create that public nuisance, we will demand for refund of every spending that has been done by the officer who have provided them. The officer concerned will have to refund all this money. We will see to that. I am assuring the people of the state. Every single paisa that they have spent just to please their political bosses, going rather by deviation from the normal course of ethical responsibility vested upon them as per the law. So this is what is going to happen. He is eligible for all those parks and facilities by virtue of the post and in sync with the given norms. Follow it. Don't deviate and misuse your power just to show off. No. I will tell you one thing. One day my daughter was coming is that do not, do not misuse it. Do it as it is necessary for the sustainability of democracy. But do not do up to that extent that it becomes a nuisance, it becomes an eyesore to the common man.
No, for me, because people are coming and telling that's why I know. Have I seen them going with those so-called uh, misuse of those kind of facilities? I have not seen them, but it is something which comes as an input from the citizens to me, to Dr. Mukul. Sir, why are you quietly watching? You know, people are concerned and it is my responsibility. And I'm telling you, we will take account of everything, accountability, because every power is inseparable inseparable from the sense of responsibility. Chief Minister's advisor, so many numbers of Chief Minister. How many Chief Minister's advisors are there? How many? Can you count? How many did I have? How many of the political appointees were, you know, escorted by police pilot, police escort? Hmm? Creating nuisance. But are they entitled? That's what I'm asking. The category of so-called protecting is determined by virtue of the perception of threat. That's why I'm saying perception of threat. Does this Daniel has perception of threat? Huh? Yes. The police has to inform the public. Public has to ask. Does he have the perception of threat? So also many others. That is what is law. And how do you see people? And uh, inputs are quite pertinent to the uh, concern of the people. It is. Therefore, uh, we'll take stock of this and then navigate accordingly what is considered as uh, something inconsistent with the, the rules and the laws. What is the election? Any misuse of position authority. As I have said, it will not be confined to only one agency or one department. It will take every, rather, we will confront every authorities in respect of the responsibility vested upon them and the accountability that they have to give to the people.